So one thing that I find really interesting is that Google, which is one of the biggest companies, one of the biggest websites in the entire world has a wide range of different AI tools that are completely free to use. And most people don't know about them. A lot of people don't even know that they exist. So in today's video, I thought I would make this general overview just to kind of introduce you guys to some of the different Google AI tools that I'm personally using myself. And I'm gonna focus this video on how these different Google AI tools can help anyone out there when it comes to either starting or running a one person online business from the comfort of your own home. So I don't wanna waste any more time. I'm gonna jump straight into one of the first Google products, which is the Google AI mode. So the way that this works is it's basically an AI powered search engine. If I just click into it just like this, this is what the interface looks like. And again, a lot of people don't know that this exists, but at the same time, it does have over a hundred million users. It's been slowly released across the world in various different countries over the past few months. And the way that it works again, is that it's basically a search engine. You can enter whatever you want into it. And the main way that people are using this right now when it comes to helping them make money is that they are building their websites, they're selling their products in a way that they're gonna be able to get it ranked in the Google AI mode. Most people that are thinking about selling products online tend to overlook AI powered search engines just like this when in reality it's completely free and when it comes to the strategies that you can put on your website to be ranked in search engines, it's not really difficult. Of course, there's gonna be a learning curve, but let me quickly show you some of the websites or maybe one particular website that has been able to get ranked in the AI mode and they're selling digital products as well. So I'm just going to type in the search term. I'm just gonna say, I am thinking about buying a digital planner to help me manage my business day-to-day -day activities. Can you show me some websites that are selling them? So of course, this search term is just me asking for sites that are selling digital planners. So let's see exactly what it's able to come back with. All right, guys. So as you can see, it's come back with these different marketplaces, you know, sites like Etsy, but it's also come back with these independent websites. So there's this one over here called Passion Planner. Let me just click into it. Okay, so this is actually a website that I've come across before. We can see that it's super simple, straightforward. They're selling all of these 2026 digital planners. They've got multiple different products listed on their site right now. And just think about the potential of doing this, you know, building a website, building a digital product, listing it on that website, doing all of the SEO backend stuff that you need to do and getting organic traffic going onto your website every single day. Because if we just take a look at similar web, and similar web for those of you that don't know what it is it's a traffic analyzer it's going to be able to look at how much visitors or how many visitors a website is getting every single month and we can see that this one is getting over 284 and the main country that they're getting traffic from is from the united states and the main traffic sources is direct and through search and it's not only digital product sites that are doing this you know there's drop shipping sites that have been able to get ranked in the google ai mode so I definitely say that this is the future of Google search. People going onto it, tapping in a search term and being able to have a conversation with Google instead of just being shown a whole bunch of different results. Of course, the main Google search engine is still the primary way that people use Google. But the fact that sites like this have been able to get ranked in the Google AI mode is definitely an indicator of what is yet to come. But this now brings me on to one of the next Google products that I'm sure 99% of you that's watching this video have probably heard of, which is Google Gemini. Now Google Gemini works in a very similar way to ChatGPT in the sense that you go onto it, you enter a prompt and it's gonna be able to give you answers back. As you can see, the interface looks very similar to ChatGPT. And in terms of the different AI tools that I'm personally using right now on a day-to-day -day basis, personal and business, I would say the two main ones is ChatGPT and Gemini, especially when it comes to these different LLMs, which are language learning models. These are the two main ones that I use and I use them for different reasons. Now, the main reason why I use something like Google Gemini is because it's directly connected to Google. And when I'm doing stuff with my business that relies on Google search or just Google SEO, I like to use Gemini because I know that I'm gonna be able to get the best possible answer. In addition to that, Gemini is completely free to use. So that's definitely another benefit because ChatGPT, I personally pay around $29 every single month to use it. So if you're deciding between using ChatGPT or Gemini, 
Of course, ChatGPT does have its benefits, but at the same time, Gemini is definitely up there. And I wanna show you one interesting way that Gemini works that so many people still don't know that they can do this with it, which is to use it when it comes to building up a digital business checklist. So you're gonna to have to get a prompt and you're gonna to have to use this one over here. I'm gonna leave it linked down below. It's completely free to use. Let's assume that I wanted to build up a business selling digital planners. I'm gonna select this answer right there, click on next. What is your skill level? I'm gonna say that I'm advanced. Why do you want to make a digital product to sell it? What type of niche do you wanna focus on? I'm gonna say e-commerce. How do you want to sell it? I'm gonna say my own website. What color scheme do you want? Professional and clean. How do you plan to promote it? I'm gonna say that I plan to promote it using Instagram and TikTok Reels. From there, it's now gonna come back with this prompt that you're gonna be able to copy just like this. And then go back over to Gemini. You're gonna click on tools. You're gonna to click on canvas and you can paste the prompt in there just like that. And as you can see, it's writing out the entire code, everything that's necessary when it comes to building out this interactive business checklist. Don't worry, you don't need to do anything with the code whatsoever. When it's done, you're going to see something similar to this. And what I'm gonna do is just make it full screen so that we can get a better look. And as you can see, this is the digital checklist that Gemini was able to make. It's given me everything I need to know when it comes to succeeding with this business. The estimated monthly revenue based on the daily traffic is giving me the best titles to focus on when it comes to the ones that's going to bring the most income, medium income, low, the competitors that I'm going to be able to click into and check out. It's also come back with the best domain names for me to choose from, the blog titles that's going to give my website that initial boost and just a general step-by-step -step checklist when it comes to getting this business off the ground. So this is definitely one of the interesting ways that Gemini works that not that many people know. And it's not just with advanced things like this. So this is definitely one of the most interesting ways that you can use something like Gemini when it comes to helping you with a one person online business. And it's not just this, if I just go back over to the main page, if I'm gonna be honest with you, Gemini has so many different features. And if I was to go through every single one of them in this video, we're gonna be here for the next hour. But one of the next newest features that they've recently added is something called Gemini Gems. And the way that you can access this is by clicking on these three lines at the top over here. And you're gonna see Explore Gems right here. So you could just click into it. And what this is going to do is that it's gonna take you over to this page. And for those of you that's not really sure of what a gem is, it's basically like creating your own Google Gemini, your own chat GPT, by giving it the initial source reference for it to refer to. Because the way that Gemini works, chat GPT, all of these different LLMs, you're gonna ask it a question and it's going to scan the entire internet for it to give you an answer back. But let's say if you wanted Gemini to focus on giving you specific answers based on a specific thing that you're dealing with. Let's say if you got a contract from a business, you can insert it into the knowledge base right here. And whenever you have a conversation with the gem, it's always going to look at the contract and not veer off and give you random answers back. And the same thing applies if you have a digital product that you wanna sell. There's this ebook that I made not too long ago. It's an ebook when it comes to helping people build up an e-commerce business. And I've already exported it as a PDF. As you can see, I've been able to do it over here. So I'm now gonna be able to upload it in this section by clicking on add files. And I'm also gonna be able to tell it the instructions. I'm gonna say, you are an assistant with the number one job of helping me get more traffic from Google search to help me sell this ebook. So I'm gonna call it Google SEO assistant, and then I'm gonna click on save. Okay, perfect. So it's now been created and I'm now gonna be able to ask it a basic question. I'm gonna say, what is the title of my ebook? Just to make sure that it definitely knows what my ebook is about. Okay, perfect. So that is the name of the ebook, the e-commerce launch pad scaling to your first five figures online. So I'm now gonna be able to say, give me the top five blog articles for this particular ebook. Okay, there we go. It's now come back with the best blog titles that have a high chance of doing well. Bear in mind, this is a Google AI product. So again, we're gonna be able to trust the information that is given back to us. And for those of you that don't know, you can actually take it a step further and say, write a 1000 word SEO rich article with the title of, and I'm just going to use this article over here. 
And Google Gemini is then going to be able to produce the entire article that you can now copy over to whatever platform you're using, whether you're using Shopify, whether you're using Hostinger, whether you're using Horizons, whichever one you're using, you're going to be able to use this article, of course, make changes to it. But instantly, as you can see, it's been able to come back with a fully produced article that I can use straight away if I wanted to. But this now brings me on to one of the next Google products that I've been using quite a lot recently, which is Notebook LM. Now, this one tends to confuse a lot of people, but at the same time, it's also really popular. And for those of you that might be confused about it, it's a really simple tool and it works very similar to the Google gem that I just showed you in the way that you can upload an initial source document and it's always going to refer to it. But Notebook LM does have some other capabilities that is really useful when it comes to generally being able to start up, whether it's a physical product business, a digital product business, and I'm just gonna quickly walk you through it. So as you can see, I'm on the homepage right now, and you're gonna be able to access this by going over to notebooklm.google. Once again, the one thing that's really good about a lot of these Google products is that they're completely free. Now, of course, you can sign up for their pro account, I would say that you don't necessarily need to do that. 99% of you are going to be able to benefit from the free account. So you don't need to bother too much with that. All you need to do is make sure that you've got a Gmail email address similar to the rest of the Google AI tools. And then from there, you're just going to click on try notebook LM. Okay, so this is what the next page is going to look like once you've logged in. And it's going to be here where you need to add your sources. So you're not going to be able to take any further steps until you tell notebook LM what you want it to know. So I'm going to upload the ebook that I just downloaded. So I'm just going to click on choose file. Okay, perfect. So that's now been added. It knows everything about my ebook and there's going to be so many different things that you're going to be able to do. For example, one of the first things that you can do is get a video overview of your ebook. You're going to be able to watch it through and just understand the information in your ebook. And by watching the video, you're going to be able to see if there's any issues, any mistakes. Of course, you need to read through it, but having a video for you to watch, it's just going to clarify so many things, especially if you haven't spent too much time going through everything in your ebook word for word. This is one of the latest features that they've added. I'm not going to click on it right now because it takes about 10 minutes for the video to load but it's an AI generated video, AI voice, and it's really good in terms of the visuals, really engaging. So I definitely advise that you check it out and you're gonna be able to get a video overview on any topic. But you can also use Notebook LM for so many different simple things as well. So let's say if I wanted to use it, I don't know, to make a ebook cover for me to sell this ebook. I'm gonna be able to get a prompt for me to do that. So I'm just going to come over here and say, give me a prompt for nano banana for it to make the best ebook cover possible for this book i am selling so i'm just going to enter in this prompt and let's see exactly what it comes back with and just like that as you can see it's now come back with a prompt for nano banana for me to make this ebook cover and again, you can use it for so many other things. You can use it for coming up with a content calendar. Maybe if you wanted a structured step-by-step -step blueprint on what type of content to post on Instagram, on your website, on YouTube, whatever it is, because it knows all of the information about your ebook, it's going to be able to give you a detailed content plan that you're going to be able to follow. But I've got another video coming out about Notebook LM in the next couple of days, a detailed breakdown. It's going to be a 30 minute video going into detail as to how I'm using it with the different internet businesses that I'm running. So be sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification so that you don't miss that video. But this now brings me on to the next Google AI product. And I've already mentioned it, which is Nano Banana. So if I just copy this prompt, I'm just going to go back over to Google Gemini. And by now, I'm sure that most of you already know what Nano Banana is. It's an image generation tool and it's going to be able to produce a unique image that doesn't exist on the Internet within a few seconds. Now, this is definitely a powerful tool because it has so many different use cases. You can use it when it comes to producing content for whatever type of business you're running. You can also use it when it comes to making images that's going to go onto your website. And you can also use it when it comes to product mockups for physical products and digital products. Because as you just saw, I got this prompt from Notebook LM. So I'm going to be able to paste it in there like this. And then from here, you now need to click on tools and then click on create images and then click on submit. And right here, as you can see, this is an example of the type of ebook cover that it's able to make. Super professional, looks clean. You know, if I wanted to make this myself, it would have been really difficult to get the angles right. 
And if I wanted to pay someone, they probably would have charged me $30 and taken two days to do it. And of course, this is just a simple example of how Nano Banana works. Again, you can use it for so many other things. But this now brings me on to one of the final Google products that I'm going to quickly talk about, which is the Google AI Studio. Now, most people believe that the Google AI Studio and Gemini are the exact same thing and they work in the exact same way. And to be honest, they do in some ways, but in some ways they don't. One of the most unique ways that I've been able to use Google AI Studio is with the API connection. There's actually a way that you can get your completely free API key. And then you can now use that API key when it comes to automating a business that's going to be able to get traffic for you to your website every single day automatically. And I'm going to quickly break it down for you. So as you can see, I'm on the Google AI Studio right now. And the way that you can get your API key is clicking on this button right here. And from here, once again, you're going to be able to create a completely free API key. Now, for many of you that are beginners, you're probably wondering, Sam, what exactly are you talking about? And how is this going to make me money online? Well, as we've already discussed, there's multiple different websites that are running right now that are built by people no different than yourself that are selling products, dropshipping products, digital products, and they're using organic blog articles to get traffic to their site. And they don't sit there writing the articles one by one. They don't even use Gemini when it comes to writing the articles and copy and pasting it. Maybe initially that's what they do. But what they mainly do is that they build AI automations with tools like make.com. And with this API key from your Google AI Studio, you're going to be able to go on to make.com for completely free. And you're going to be able to build out a sequence, which isn't going to take you more than 10, 15 minutes. Connect it to your platform so that blog articles are going to be produced every single day. And this is something that I showcased in a previous video. As you can see on the screen right now, this is an automation that I set up where every single day at the exact same time, a fully written article is going to be published. And this is going to be with the help of Google Gemini, but the way that it's running is with the Google AI Studio API key because everything has been integrated. My Shopify store has been integrated and just everything needs to be integrated in terms of the Google Sheet as well for all of the articles to be produced. Now, I don't want to spend too much time on this in today's video because as I just mentioned, I recently made a video breaking everything down click by click. So you're going to be able to watch that by clicking the link right there. That video has helped out so many people. I've gotten so much positive feedback from it. It's going to be able to give you some insights into some other ways that you can use all of these free Google AI tools to help you build up a one person business that could potentially make you money online. And don't forget to like this video if you've enjoyed it and you've gotten any sort of value from it. It allows me to know what type of videos you guys like to see. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Hit the bell notification so that YouTube can let you know once a new video has been released. But other than that, guys, as always, I'm going to catch you on that next video. Make sure you stay safe out there. Peace.